Hello everybody, Van Berman here. Um, <clears throat> I've just managed to get on to Rome 2. I'm sorry that my voice is a bit croaky. I've um, not been up for too long. But what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be reading the benchmark of the game. Um, unfortunately, it's in. I've not worked out yet how to change it from DirectX 11. Um, the point is because it doesn't actually fit well on my monitor, and I don't want to play it in windowed mode, so. Yeah. You can probably imagine what that's like. And now the um, I can see you see I don't get what it is. I can see the game on my recording software, but I can't actually see it. Um, the full screen won't load. I don't know what. I had a similar problem with Shogun too, though, so I'm not really sure what it is. Oh, my tea's going gold. Hold on a second. Right, he's gone. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I'm running the benchmark, or I'm hoping to. Um, pretty sure I need to be in full screen mode. I'm pretty sure I need to be on the application to do it. <laughs> so I presume it's just going to be like um, a cutscene, and then, or well, not cutscene, but a general speech, and then the battle. So <clears throat> yeah, uh, I know benchmarking isn't terribly brilliant, but you better see how good my system is. I don't think it's that good. <laughs> it's good, but I mean, um, I don't really know what I mean. It's good, but I wonder how good it's because this is why I decided to do recording. I want to see how good it is when it's recording. And if anything, it's going to be my hard drive lets me down. But I uh, oh will. In the minute, I'm still just waiting for it to load. I like that we've got the quotes back uh, on the loading screens. I hope it's not all the same quote, although I guess it's a bit difficult to to pick new quotes. <laughs> but um, yeah, maybe not. I hope they add, I hope they find some more to put in. That'd be pretty cool. Um, here we go. Oh, wow, this is rubbish. See, the game automatically detected my settings and said that I was, you know, like, max everything out. And I was thinking, hmm. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm pretty sure that without recording, my settings are going to be pretty high. But, um, you know, I don't think I need full anti aliasing and all that stuff. I can't actually see what the frames per second are. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Benchmark summary. Average FPS, oh, 33. So I guess, really, that's... Uh, about right, I guess. Just must have been the heavy stuff at the end. But still, never mind. So yeah, this is what they gave me, and I was just, just like, what? Anti-aliasing, uh, oh. I don't know. Oh, I want it. I want V-Sync on, obviously. That was one of the problems. Um, Death of Field, love that off. Well, I'm going to stick everything up to very high. Um, just because, oh, I don't know, I want ease of, like... Oh, but I do want the unit detail to be good. Tell you what, I'll leave the unit, de I'll leave the unit detail up and stick buildings on medium. Uh, unit size. Ooh. I'm going to go for large. Particle effects, wasn't it? If your game is running slow, you might introduce us. Alright, so that's high them. Uh, yeah, shader model, that's fine. Sky extreme. Does it need to be extreme? Anyway, so yeah, just knocking these down a little bit. I mean, I think knocking them down to ultra is not the, you know, the worst thing ever. Uh, texture quality. I do like my textures, though. And I'll leave anti-lacing on for now. And we'll go with that. Uh, I'm still trying to work out. I, I need a I need a new resolution though, guys. Running window. I don't want to run it in a window though. See how crap's that gonna be if I have to run it in a window? Hmm. Yeah, not overly happy about this. I'm gonna have to change it to DirectX. Uh, 10 is it, I think? 
And so yeah, anyway, thank you very much for watching, and um, I will see you very soon with some videos, as I now have everything up and running. So thank you very much, guys. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.